Sheriff's Department vehicle, drove into the apartment complex parking lot and saw a Kia Forte matching the description parked in a parking space. The deputies parked their patrol car and approached the Kia on foot. Mr. Twyman was seated in the driver's seat and a male adult was seated in the front passenger seat. The driver deputy walked to the driver's side of the Kia while the passenger deputy walked to the right rear passenger door of the Kia with their weapons drawn. The passenger deputy opened the passenger side rear door of the Kia and made contact with Mr. Twyman and his companion. Mr. Twyman started the Kia's engine. The driver deputy moved to the driver's door of the Kia and attempted to open the driver's door. At this time, the Kia's reverse lights illuminated and Mr. Twyman accelerated the vehicle in reverse as it turned in a counterclockwise direction toward the deputy on the passenger side. As the Kia reversed, the passenger side deputy was struck with the open rear passenger door and pushed into the center of the parking lot as he attempted to maintain his balance to avoid being knocked down and run over. At that time, both deputies fired their service pistols at Mr. Twyman in order to stop the vehicle from seriously injuring the passenger deputy. The Kia continued in reverse in a looping turn as the deputies fired in the direction of Twyman. The driver deputy retreated to his patrol vehicle and retrieved a patrol rifle from the trunk. Both deputies appeared to fire additional shots in the direction of the Kia. We did recover closed circuit video surveillance footage from two separate cameras that recorded the incident in its entirety. Both videos will now be played for your review. Please note, the service firearms used by the deputies are equipped with flashlights mounted under the firearms barrel. You will see a mixture of what we currently believe are muzzle flashes and flashlights being illuminated. 